Good morning. Well, good morning guys. It's about 5 o'clock in the morning here. I'm just getting loaded up with bait. Everything's ready to go. Josh is on his way here. And then we're headed down to Damariscotta Lake to hopefully meet a bunch of you guys. We're going there with a couple other YouTubers. We got Joe Holland, Josh from Precision Angling, Jesse from Mainly Outdoors, and Chris and Liv from Fishing for Adventure. We're all going to be there today. Hopefully you guys saw all of our posts about this and uh, you were able to make it, but um, I'm not really sure what I'm going to film down there, but we'll film some stuff, take you along. It's going to be like a little fishing seminar slash hang out with us slash fish with us slash not sure. So let's get loaded up, get down there. We'll uh, check back in with you guys when we actually get to the lake. Oh, and I'm testing out this new Frabel bait station here. I'm, uh, I'm ditching the Coleman bucket because it freezes up way too much. So we're gonna try that out, let you guys know what I think of that. All right, we have made it. <laughs> yeah. Holy crap. It's not warm out, huh? Yeah, we're going to nice meet you. Find the meet you. Yeah. Hey, Hi, there nice you go. Yeah. Wow. Nice. What's up, bud? Hey, how's, how's it going? going? Hey, nice to meet you. Finally. Good, you too. We'll get you set up right next to Over here. All right. Yeah. Give me a hand real quick. You got a little I bit of a rough trap, huh? Who said? Oh yeah. What was it? It uh, the weather was not good, but. No, I mean the, with the sled. Yeah. Oh, with this? Yeah. I don't know what happened. No idea. I think I just flooded it or something. There. I don't know. Look at that. How's it going? Hey, good. Uh, What's going on there? Yeah. Uh, Who's that? This is Josh. My cousin. Yeah. Well, I've seen you on the video. Yeah. 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 I like that, that's pretty cool. Yeah, it's a good setup. I just snatched my window when I was putting oh, it in. Oh shit. Yeah. I didn't notice. Yeah. Hey, if you want, I'll go drop this off. I can pull yeah, yours down. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's perfect. Well, I got a bigger jack coming. Uh, Wayne, just the bigger base. He's got like a Chris, right? How are we doing? Yeah, how are hey. we doing, man? Yeah, nice to meet you, finally. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Coffee donuts over here, man. How oh, yeah. Awesome. Yo, I have yeah. thousands. Yeah. I don't know, guys. What do you think? This is my new sled, or? Yeah. <laughs> How's it going, man? Yeah, that thing's a... Coffee and donuts right there. Yeah, that thing's a rig, huh? Oh, That's it's awesome. crazy. <laughs> Take it for a rip, if you want. Yeah. Crazy, yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, we made it out on the ice. You can see everybody set up over here. We've got the Eskimo crew going. Me and Josh, we're in the otter, and Jesse's got the big boy clam. So, to finish setting up, and then we'll go see what's going on.
gonna zip out to this guy Shaq. He said he talked to him earlier. He said he spent the night out here. And I want to check out his little wood stove he's got. And uh, he's got some traps that he built, or his relative built up there that he sounds like they're pretty sweet. He bought some freeze proof, proof reels off me, so I'll go check those out real quick. Down yeah, I know. I, yeah, I know. I got busy down there. <laughs> how are you? Good. How are you? Good. Catching many trout? They got a couple down there. Did they really? They got one pretty nice brown that was like 21 inches or so. Somebody yeah. got down there. Wow. That's a stove we got there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Kinko bought on a Cabela's. Yeah. Just pulled it out. Yeah. Huh. Still going, actually. Yeah. yeah That's a pretty good sign. That was the first time you used that? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I bet that got pretty warm in there with that it thing. Did. It did. It was nice. <laughs> yeah. I was impressed. Six, six hours. All, yeah. all of six hours. Yeah. You know, it was 24 inches long. So. Huh. Yeah. You say you had those traps that you were... Yeah. So I'll check them out. Check one out. We used some fancy wood. Curly maple. Yeah. Walmart, curly maple. Yeah. Huh. So that's just sitting in there, or is that in like a? Brass? It's just routered, yeah. and actually, yeah. right here, this hole. Oh, right? oh it's yeah. resting on you that. You take that out, you put grease in there. Yeah, and it fills that tube up. Huh? Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's, that was kind of the genius huh. idea. Look at this. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Look at this thing. All right, we gotta check this shack out by Sebago Bait. This thing is sick. They held this thing out with a four-wheeler earlier. Oh man, that's cool. Oh, they got a little generator. That's awesome. Wow. We just had to check this thing out. Come <laughs> check it out. Yeah. We're in there digging right now. We yeah. Catching a few birds here and there. Cool. Nothing huge. Stuff. Did you do you trailer this on the road like oh, that? Yeah. 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 Just so basically, what we'll do is we'll put those jacks up. Yeah. And a lift up in the back. Yeah. And then I have like an app on my phone, oh, yeah. and then I just hit it like this. Nobody wants. And no, I'll bring the front up, and then you flip Thank this you wheel back. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah, it locks in there. Yeah. But no shit. Sure. That's how you would flip it. Yeah. And then that's you just cool. Put this pin in that. If you lose that pin, that's not good. Yeah. <laughs> I got a stove in here and everything. Oh, really? So there's screen on that one, and then this one's going, and then I can get either both of them at the same time. That's cool. This set right up. Turn it down. There's a microwave, cooktop, this stove. It's a pretty good little rig. Everything's all foam filled. Yeah. So it only weighs fifteen hundred pounds. Yeah. No kidding. Floats, We're... but I don't want to find out. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> that back door must come down. Yeah, so yeah, so what happens is throw a sled in here. Huh. Yeah, the four wheeler that's yeah. outside that comes right in. <laughs> that's yeah. awesome. Jesus so that's how we got when we got here, this was behind my truck. I dropped it down, backed out the four wheeler, disconnected from the truck, hooked to the four wheeler, and out that's we go. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> that is awesome. And it can yeah, run yeah. off the battery, but we we bring a little generator with us. Yeah. It's yeah. cold blooded. Yeah. yeah, it's quiet up there. I didn't even yeah, know you had yeah, it until yeah, we walked yeah. around back. Yeah. 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 Oh, she's getting them by hand. Yeah. <laughs> that's pretty good. Go, Courtney. Oh, that's a good one. There you go. Yeah. Nice. Bigger one. Bigger one. <laughs> yeah. Like them that way, so I'm a prime rib. <laughs> I'm on it. Let me know when you find it. All right, yeah, I'll take a burger if they're done. Thanks, Thanks. appreciate it. <laughs> Pretty cool, isn't it? How you doing? Good, how are you? Good, good. Joe's shack here. I am in the legendary Joe Holland's ice shack. He doesn't know it. I'm not gonna sleep in his bed, but this is what he. This is what he uses. You, you make your own axiom. That's pretty sweet. The boot that got the boot dryer there. Nice and warm in here. Yeah, the floor is nice. Yeah, yeah. I think I have it in sport mode right now. The sport regular eco mode. Okay. Run it sport so you can rip it. Yeah. 
for it right now. You're good to go. Brake, gas, yeah. that's it. Right. If you want, you can switch the gas this way. Yeah. That's kind of comfortable. Yeah. It's whatever you like. She'll lift the skis. Yeah. Take a rip if you want. All right. Feel free. free. To rip it oh yeah yeah it's, it'll hang it'll hang the skis no problem huh? easy it'll hang the skis at 40 miles an hour yeah so. that's fun yep it's, it's uh, wicked smooth obviously brand new too I mean, it's yeah. gonna go good but yeah i had her up to 82 and it still had more that was telling yeah yeah but it's that's got awesome. all sorts of power it's got high low gear yeah yeah um, did everything yeah actually i'll plug in that back seat because they're, they're gonna take it for a rip so oh I yeah the, i want the back seat hand warmers on yeah so you like yeah. it i do i was looking at the uh yeah definitely the turbo version yep. same thing but i i had nothing to compare it to really as far as power wise but i i was the only guy out of my group that didn't get the turbo out of the, yeah. the, that big group yeah and the turbo will get you another 10 miles yeah. an hour all right guys future me here i'm editing this video right now and i really kind of i lost a lot of footage to be honest with you i had my chesty on in the morning it worked well for a little while it got it was pretty cold and for some reason I'm not even sure what happened, I've never had it happen before, but my GoPro got frozen up and would only record about three seconds of video and then it was shut off. So I just switched my power banks out and it was all fine after that, but I lost about, I don't know, two hours worth of, of footage here and that was when I really met a lot of people. I met a whole bunch of you guys, some of you guys that were subscribers of mine, some of you guys were subscribers of some of the other YouTubers and you met me for the first time. We had people that traveled from out of state to be here, uh, Rhode Island. Connecticut, Massachusetts, New York, all over the place. I mean, it's really unbelievable. We had over 300 people show up to this event. The support we got was really overwhelming. I mean, I, I had no idea that this event was gonna be this big. We promoted it sort of like a fishing seminar for people that were new to ice fishing, wanted to learn. So I did a little bit of that. I helped a few people set their first traps. We ended up doing a big giveaway for door prizes. And we gave away everything from jack traps, to other ice fishing gear, I gave Ray's heritage trap. I donated a lure pack from Trout Whisper Tackle Company. It was about a hundred dollar value, and uh, someone won that, uh, a young kid. So hopefully he's going to be happy with that this spring, and hopefully catch him trout on that. We also gave away a lifetime license to a young a young kid. That's pretty special right there. Hopefully that kid will really enjoy that and, and get a lot of use out of that uh, throughout his life. But. But I also didn't really get to introduce you guys to these channels. It, it was just a lot going on during the day. It was it was kind of hard to like get everybody together. We didn't really get to talk to each other all that much until the end, when everybody kind of left. So I'm hoping in the future that I'll collaborate with these people more and we'll introduce them to the channel more formally. Uh, you guys have met Jesse uh, mainly outdoors through my channel already. We fished together a couple times. But the other guys... Josh from Precision Angling, Joe Holland, and Chris and Liv from Fishing for Adventure. We haven't hooked up with them just yet. So I'm going to leave links to their channels down in the description below. If you guys like fishing content up in Maine, go follow these guys. You won't be disappointed. There's a lot of good information and uh, a lot of interesting content to watch. So thank you to everybody who showed up to this event. Like I said, it was way bigger than I thought it was going to be. We had that boat ramp completely chuck-a-block full of cars all the way out to Route 213. We were almost shutting down the road out there. There were so many people. If you guys didn't make it this year, we might try to do this again next year. Comment down below if you made it out to this event and uh, if you'd come to the one next year if we do it again. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. And we'll catch you guys in the next video.